So Bev, taking a little different perspective, I'd love to hear how you've been working with your clients and you know, when they're reaching out to you and wanting support and help, what are they coming to you for and how have you been helping them and advising them through these times? Well, they're not coming to me for technology. <laughs> they're coming to me for how do you stay humanly connected? And, and you know, Stacy, I loved that you said start at the middle. Um, and, you know, in my work, I've always been concerned so much attention to high potentials and the massive middle is, is being uh, ignored. And I always like to say our attention's on high pose and forget about the po pose. And the popos are passed over and pissed off. And so I've always uh, believed in the treasure. Uh, and maybe this is the time from a career standpoint to look at the redeployment opportunities um, that one of you mentioned and think about oh, how do we give people in this crazy period um, more exposure, um, more opportunity to think about um, their own mobility options. Um, and, you know, the thing that one of you talked about, I wrote in the word staying connected. I think that um, what I hear from clients, individuals want to be touched by their managers. You know, it, 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 they want to be asked, how are you doing? And um, managers whose heads are overwhelmed with everything else, the thought of reaching out and then what do I say and how do I do it, um, it, it is a hard additional thing to take on. One of the things I'm going to send you all um, that you can use any way you want is I took the 26 um, letters of the alphabet from Love em. I wrote um, 26 questions that any busy manager could pick up the phone and ask a remote employee. So you're welcome to use it. You know, Katrina, you'll help me make sure everybody gets it because it's that how are you doing in many different ways? Um, that I think individuals want to be asked. And, and busy managers need a list of questions. Th they actually need to be told, try this one <laughs> and listen to the answer and then go one step uh, 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 deeper. Um, it, it, so I'm, I guess I'm uh, uh, back to the basics and the engagement that I do. And in the career work, you know, some organizations think no one's interested in career during this crazy time. Oh, yes, they are. And oh, yes, they are worried. And oh, yes, they are thinking ahead. And oh, yeah, managers too. So it's how do we keep that going while we keep the is going as well, you know, and I'm into simple, quick, practical, how do you do it inexpensively, you know, and easily. So that's how I'm, I'm helping. Really you know, I'm calling myself now and it, it's, 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 it's a good a guide on the side and a sage on the stage. So the guide on the sidey stuff, I'm loving as well as the, the talks that I, I keep giving. And I love Catherine Metz. <laughs> and she has every skill set that I do not have. And we realize between us, you know, we have a couple of ideas. I don't know how we'll get to put them out, but we have ideas. Anyway, so nice to meet you all. Thank you so much, Bev. And you are someone who uh, really doesn't need an introduction, but I would love for you to give a quick snapshot of who you are and the work that's led you to here, just so we can capture that as well. Uh, 
so um, work that's led me to here. I, I've just always been in, in uh, how people grow. Uh, and, and maybe Adam from my day at Brandeis University, and I lived in Cambridge. Uh, uh, it was watching college kids. Here's what I think the aha uh -huh was. I, wa I worked at A schools that only took A students. Um, and those students felt, if an A student, I stand in an A line, an A life will be offered to me because of my heritage and my smarts. And when they found the A life didn't happen as they thought, they did have alternatives. So it led me into believing how important it was to have not just one game plan, but several game plans and to hold them simultaneously, which is what all the career development work and up is not work kind of uh, centered on. Incredible. So um, I'm interested in thinking out of the box to develop old ideas, new ways. Yeah. Maybe that's a way to talk. A perfect way to describe it. I think so many of us <laughs> from your work.